Okay, today we're going to show you a buffalo chicken wing dip recipe that I make. Okay, what I did is I started already the chicken to save you some time. That's about three quarters of a pound of chicken breast. I got it sliced up, okay? And it's cooking in a pan now. So I wanted to get a little head start so you can see. Okay, so that is all cooking. I added a little butter at the bottom of the pan. But that is chicken breast strips, okay? Now, they were little tenders. I bought them today, and they were little tenders. You need about two cups of that, so they may be a little extra. But they were little tenders, and I sliced them up myself. You can also get the canned chicken. I like to cook it up myself. Now, this is already pre-softened, eight ounces of cream cheese. I got a half of a big block here, Topps cream cheese, nothing expensive, again. Now, I'm going to add some ranch dressing to it. Half a cup. Hot sauce. Half a cup. Right there is a cup of both. We mix this right in with the cream cheese. Add it right in there, okay? So we're going to get that in there. Start mixing it in. I've already preheated the oven 350 degrees. We're going to actually bake this when it's done. See, because I use a mixing bowl. But it's also a baking dish, so I can bake it all at the same time. Okay, as you can see, it's all softened. Oh, look at that. It looks good, ready to go here. A little sour cream in there, a little cream cheese, a little hot sauce. We make it a buffalo kind of chicken wing sauce. See, now this way I can bake this in a pan, serve it in the same thing, and not have to worry about something new you know something else different okay so we're going to mix this up really good you know now i'm also going to add it's not quite mixed yet i know i'm also going to add a half a cup of cheddar cheese now i like that to use the cheddar cheese in it because i like cheese i like a lot of cheese so i'm going to throw a half a cup of that in there and we're going to mix that in too while the chicken is cooking Mix it all up. Oh, doesn't that look good? Doesn't that just look good? Uh, chicken wing dip. So, like I said, I got three quarters of a pound of chicken breast cooking, and look at that. Doesn't that look great? It looks to be done to me. All cooked up, okay? Now, now that it's all cooked up, I'm going to shut the burner off. I'll have you know I just bought my burner set. Now, once it's cooked up like this, we're going to take this bowl here. And we're going to set it aside. I'm going to take the top off this pan. Okay. And I'm going to set it aside for a second. Because now I want to get a little bit more thinner sliced chicken if I can. Okay. So what we'll do... I'll take the spoon and I'll scoop it out. Now those are pretty good sized chunks there. Not too bad. They're pretty thin. And then I'm going to just slice them a little bit more. Try to mix them up a little bit. Not much. You know, to mix it in a little better. And some chunks you want. I mean, some people like grabbing that chicken wing dip, having a nice bowl of it. And grabbing it up and having a nice piece of chicken on it. Cut it a little bit. Throw it in the cup. Look at that. A little bit. Oh, see? And it's going to fall apart a little bit too and shred up, so that's good. So take a little bit more out. Now, I don't know how much chicken you like to use. I like to use about three quarters of a pound boneless, skinless chicken breast. And I like, sometimes I'll use a little bit more, but it's about two cups. Two cups. I like a lot of chicken in it. My preference, maybe not yours. Like I said, mix it, munch it up a little bit more. Doesn't take a lot. Just cut, cut, cut. As you can see, it's pretty much falling apart anyhow. And so that makes it better. It'll be in, in this, mix in better with a dip. Now, after we're done with this, we're going to throw it in. There, I'm just showing you two cups. Real quick. And after we're done, let's see where we get some more out here. You can see it's kind of a lot of juice in there too. So it's kind of tender. 
I got sitting here, of course, myself. I'm Terry. Please like and subscribe to my channel. That would be wonderful if you like the video. Uh, of course, I'm here with my dog, Apollo, who is right under my feet as usual. He's kind of still a puppy. He loves his daddy. Okay, so now I've got this all kind of cut up. Okay, like that. I like to cook it and then cut it a little more because it actually really cuts up, cuts a lot easier and a lot finer when you do it that way. And it's, it's a lot easier to manage. So now what we're going to do is we're going to take all this, like I said, two cups of chicken breast, which is approximately three quarters of a pound of skinless, boneless chicken breast. I got one already in, and that's going to be pretty much two cups. Let me get the rest out of there. Okay, real quick. Don't want to lose my pieces here. There we go. Throw that in the bowl now with the rest of the items. Now what we're going to do is take it, mix it all up together. Oh, look at that. Doesn't that look great? Lots of chicken. And I mean, you want lots of chicken if it's chicken wing sauce or dip, I mean. And that's awesome. And, you know, and speaking of that, one of my next videos, trying to get it done before the Super Bowl, is going to be chicken wing sauce for your chicken wings. Because I'm having wings on the Super Bowl. Pizza, wings, dips. I got a taco dip coming up very shortly, too. Okay, as you can see, that's mixed up pretty good there. Looks good. Even it out a little bit. Now what I'm going to do next is I'm going to sprinkle a little bit of cheddar cheese. Eh, a little more even. I'm going to sprinkle a little more cheddar cheese over the top of it. You're going to bake this for about 20 minutes, half hour. Okay, once we get the cheese all over, sprinkle over the top. And as you can see, it's just mild cheddar cheese. You just want to cover it pretty evenly is what you want to do. And with that, we are going to be off to putting it in the oven. It's easy as that. Uh, put it in the oven, like I said, for about 20 minutes, and we'll be back shortly. Okay, there you have it. 20 minutes later. Got a few little tortilla chips here. That, my friends, is chicken wing dip. Look at that, nice and close. Let's get ourselves a little chip here and take a look at, oh yeah. Look at that cheese and chicken. Uh-huh. Well, now that I have your mouth watering, time to get cooking. You have a nice day. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please like it if you like it, share it, and you know what? Subscribe. It don't cost anything. Hey, salsa video coming up next. Have a nice day.